lot of times exercise them, feed them properly, make sure that they're exposed to other animals. Ukraine, hi. Is he a mama's boy or daddy's boy? I think it's like depends on the moment, but I'm not sure if you guys saw the challenge where like Mark ran that way, I ran that way, but he went to Mark. <laughs> Guatemala, France, Mooner. Hey, what's up to me, Dio? Are you on that? Yep. Happy Sunday! What's up, everybody? Thanks for hanging out with us today. We have an afternoon with Just Moon. Isn't that so nice, Puffer? Hey, Puffa Duffa. We had requests to bust out the talking buttons, so we're going to do that. We'll do some talking, give Moon some treats. Maybe give you guys an update on Get his you guys little... over to him. Hold on. There we go. Friend. His pig friend that he got from his birthday. If you guys were on live with us for his birthday, he got a pig that he destroyed. But that's okay. Yeah, 12 a.m. here, you guys. Is it? No, it's p.m. Or 12 p.m., sorry. All right, for anybody that's on our Instagram, we'll see you over on YouTube and we will bust out our talking buttons and we'll chat with you guys soon. Link is in the bio. Whoop! We're gonna have some people come over to YouTube, pupper. I'm gonna get some. Moon is actually four years old. He just turned four. We had a party for him. YouTube supporter, you said Instagram, I'm guessing nice. Thank you for coming by. We are going, so you want to hold this? I'm going to get some treats yeah. and stuff. Hey, guys. Fluffer. Oh, that's okay. Oh. It's okay that you weren't on our birthday live. We actually posted his birthday video, and then this week we're going to post the video that we did for going to New York City. So we went to New York to meet our new friends. Hey, Space Funk. And... We, ha we did like a vlog about it, so we'll be sure to post that this week so you guys can see. Moon's relaxing. Yeah, but look, he's like hyper alert right now. The treat treats are in your car. I don't know which ones you're talking about. The ones that we break the lunch and found them. Look at him. He's so cute. I have like... Oh, are you ready for her? I have a video from when Moon was little, and he's like running around our... We have like a... What do you call that? Like an island, I guess. He's like running around this whole thing. He's so tiny. I'll have to show you guys. Did you see Maya's new video? Yeah. We love Maya and Skaya. Hello. 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 Good boy. You want moon puppy videos? Yeah, we'll need to do like a big compilation of them. So long story short, we did not know that we were gonna do um, like an Instagram or a TikTok or a YouTube for him. So we don't have that many videos from when he was little. Say, I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. No, I love you. No, I love you. Good boy! Want to take his collar off? Yeah. So cute! Um, and yes, we support like every Husky channel that we see. Uh, 64 Mule is a big one. Gohan's another one. Of course, we love Kiyosh, Milper, Maya, Skaya, Mika, Ki and Sherpa. Yeah, yeah so. Maya, Skaya, Mika. There's a lot of them. There's so many. Mooner. Are you going to keep this up though? And yes, Moon is a boy. He just turned four. Oh, yeah. No. Oh, yeah. Say, oh, yeah. Good boy. He's very barky today, guys. Sorry. I'm very excited to see you guys right <laughs> He's now. excited, though. Yeah. And did Champ like Moon? Yeah. So it's it was so cute how well Champ and Tyson and Moon got along. No. <laughs> 
too intense. I know, but you're being too intense. <laughs> no, <laughs> sit, sit. Sit. Kavya said, when my dog was a puppy, I did not take photos of him, and you're upset for that. Yeah, that's us too. I mean, so you have to be <laughs> no, you gotta be calm. <laughs> Of course, we have like pictures you and videos and stuff, but so, nothing compared to like. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Back up! Back up! Back up! <laughs> and oh, Domini sit. said, "You're my GSD and me." Hey. Good boy. Stay. <laughs> Look at how he's sitting, guys. What is this? This is real comfy, huh? <laughs> Boy, just for sitting so cute. Yeah, we ended the live video on Instagram. So we did do like a huge Q and A on Instagram. So in a little bit, we'll start answering those questions. So we're just hanging on YouTube. It's kind of like a few times we've done TikTok, Instagram, and YouTube, and it's just a lot. Like answering all the questions. We don't want to make. We want to make sure we answer everybody, but also just like. Right now, I'm using my iPad, so it's kind of hard. Hachi the Husky, yep, we follow them too. <laughs> sit, sit. I like that. What is this? What kind of sit? What in the world? What? <laughs> no, what's the, why are you sitting like that? Be calm. Good boy. Good boy. While Moon's barking, your dog is coming to you, wondering where the sound is coming <laughs> from. <laughs> that's cute. You don't have Instagram. Oh, that's awesome. So you found us like directly from YouTube? Good stay. Good boy. Moon likes cats, yeah. Roll over. I would say that cats don't really like Moon. Down. Roll over. Roll over. There he goes. Careful. Did you see his little mini rollover? Oh, mini Kind of doesn't have like that much space. <laughs> that was Don't a cute little again. rollover. Sit. Sit. Come down, come down. Sit. Good boy. Lay down. No. Lay down. Roll over. Not sit. Roll over. Good, good boy. Roll that was a good rollover. Good boy. And I'm thank you, Kavya. Yes, we do try to answer everyone's comments. And nope. even on our videos, too, we literally try to respond to every single person. And you're right. Cats don't usually love dogs, no. Okay, what is the most embarrassing thing Muna's ever done in public? Most embarrassing thing? Honestly, if he's out of the dog park and he goes to hump another dog, that's embarrassing. Uh, Mark doesn't like when Moon humps. I don't either. I don't. I don't love that. I think he like, doesn't like if another dog comes in. Yeah, yeah. So I know it's a dominance kind of thing. Oh, guys, you want to know what I think my most embarrassing thing was? So when Moon was two and a half, we had an event in New York City at Dyson, and it was a long event. So like we had to drive into New York City. <laughs> Then we had to host the event, so Moon was like the star of the hours. show, there for two hours, and the last like 15 minutes, he ended up peeing in the Dyson store, in and I Dyson was show. dead, I was dying, like, I, uh, that was probably the most embarrassing thing. This wasn't Bissell or Hoover, people, this was the Dyson, yeah, he peed everywhere. The Dyson <laughs> store, and then he like got right outside, literally like oh. on the sidewalk, and... He pooped, <laughs> like Harrow. right on the sidewalk. Harrow. Harrow. <laughs> yeah, that was definitely not, no. Hello, Moon and Fam, we're doing great. Thank you so much for asking. Childhood pictures, yeah. I'll let's try and post some baby pics of Moon and baby uh videos. Yeah, we're gonna try and find some. It's so funny because I guess because we've been with Moon for so long now, sometimes it's hard for me to tell. Um, oh, there's water. Cool. 
it's hard for me to tell like his puppy pictures versus now. I know. But he looks the same. The people who like his face markings definitely got different as he as he grew up. But he's aging really well, like a fine wine. He's so cute. Okay, Moon's favorite food. So his favorite treat is definitely a hot dog. Definitely. Like we'll cut them up into little pieces. Um but he only eats raw food. And, and as of recently, the raw food, yeah, so this is from Oma's Pride. Okay, Moon. Okay, sis. This is not for you. Stay. Stay. So he loves these. As you guys can see. They're lamb lung chips. And then we don't feel bad like giving him a bunch. We don't yeah, we don't give him a ton, but we don't feel bad giving him a little bit more than usual. And then like he always has had a raw food diet since he was like five or six months old, but as of recently he only wants white meat, so turkey and chicken. Yeah. So that's been like probably in the last three months. We thought that he was just like over the last company that we used, but come to find out he just wants white meat. Yeah. Does he like other dogs? He loves dogs. Oh he loves every dog. Literally. Moon would be the happiest husky if he had another husky in our house, but we just can't right now. Moon definitely, like, in terms of dogs, like, if you go to the dog park or the park in general, when they're sick, he'd rather play with the dogs than the people. 100%. 100%. Moon place. Ah. Moon place. Place. Wait, stay. High five. Good, good boy. boy. That was a good high five. Sorry, I feel like I'm jumping around a lot, but Moon's very, yeah, very antsy today, huh, guys? Very antsy, huh? You guys, today we're doing a video of part of how we get Moon exhausted and nice and tired and keep him exercised. It's going to be great. So Mark usually rides him on a bicycle. Say hello. <laughs> Say hello. <laughs> Arrow. Arrow. Good boy. Dual syllable, huh? That was a good one. And Mr. Big Miller said you're enjoying the recent video with the buttons. He's no, he's definitely not interested in them. So in a couple minutes, I'll take them out and show you guys that he's just like, I don't care. I love you. What would you say? Oh, yeah. Good job. That was a good one. Can you move the cord? Yeah. Sorry. And then someone said, does Moon like to meet people or does he like dogs? And I definitely think dogs. Dogs, 100%. People he doesn't mind. People he doesn't mind, especially if they're kids. He doesn't mind kids. I feel like they're on his level a little bit. Oh, he's but, so um, good with kids. Yeah. Yeah. But I feel like people, he's just like, eh, yeah, you can pet me, but I don't really need you to pet me right now. Yeah, like half Husky Bro's mom, she was trying to like pet Moon, and he was like, yeah, I don't care. <laughs> he was like, let me get your dogs. Your Corgi loves watching us. Oh my gosh, thank you. What's his favorite toy? Anything from BarkBox Super Chewer is a great toy for a Husky. If you guys were with us on our live for his birthday, we gave him this like huge pig, and he ended up destroying it. Say, I love you. Oh, Good boy, you. Mooner. Thank you. Good boy. Look at all the huskies. Look at all the dog accounts hey, on here. Hey, hey guys. <laughs> what was that at the door? <laughs> Say, oh, yeah. Can you guys hear him? I hope you guys can hear him. He's having like a very cute conversation right now. He's like toned down a little bit. She's like kinda, all right. Oh, you can, okay, cool. Yeah, he's being so quiet. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, you're not quiet. You, you can, can you be quiet? Yes. Okay, sounds good. <laughs> Is Moon always talkative? No, definitely not. He, see how Mark's holding treats in his hand right now? He's triggered by food. 
So now we can literally <coughs> wait. We can have what appears to be a conversation. <coughs> I know you want the truth. <coughs> I know you want it right now. <coughs> can you say, oh, yeah. <coughs> Good boy. So I know Mika just posted a video about this. Her dog is triggered by a word. So Moon's not triggered by words. Moon's more so triggered by the food, but also um, our two sons that are five and two. They love to be like, I love you. See how he gets? You love me. Okay. So it's something about the I love you thing that well, he's you triggered by. You have to chew it. I'm just saying, you gotta chew it when I give it to you. Okay. You promise you'll chew it. Okay. Moon has fans all over the world. Yes, we appreciate all of you guys. I hope you guys know how much we appreciate you guys. And we always tell Moon how love he is. And as you can see, we try to give him lots of love and cuddles, but he's not a very cuddly husky. <laughs> Not super cuddly. Like if we went right now and I was like, "Go over here, Bubba." No, he's, he's like, like I "Get don't away care. from me." Yeah. And as soon as he gets a the butt rubs, he'll usually come back for more butt rubs. Where are you going? Oh, Storm gets bully make boxes. We haven't tried those. Does I've Moon... heard of bully make. Yeah, I've they heard of tough, like they've had. T they have tough toys. He's getting water. Someone said, "Oh, he needs water." Oh, he... There we go. Oh, sorry, but. And then um, also, we do not let Moon sleep on our bed. Like, he's very content being by himself, being out here, being cool on the ground. Yeah. A and lot we, of. We generate so much heat in our bed, anyways. Yeah, we don't need that. And don't I, want that. I'm also kind of weird about it where I'm like, he's outside playing all day and like, he's dirty. I just, I don't need that in my bed. <laughs> We have like white sheets. I like to keep them white. But let's be real, people. Cats step in their poop and they lay in the bed. Not in my bed. That is true. What would that be doing next? Hey, Free De La Hoya. Hey, Huxtel. Now he's going to have his zoomies. Ra ra ra. Mooner. <laughs> Are you excited to go on a bike ride later? Hoxtall. Mooner, can you say hi to your friend Hoxtall? Say hi. Very good. Very good. You're so sweet. The biggest sweetheart. Moon, are you a good boy? Moon, who's a good boy? Mooner, are you a good boy? <laughs> yeah. You're a good boy. Mooner, I love you. <laughs> Good job. Good job, buddy. Putting we on a love show? you too. <laughs> are you putting on a show, Pupper? The tippity taps are so cute. I know. It's so cute. Do we follow Milper the Husky? Of course. Of course we do. Especially because they have kids. That's like a great channel to like collaborate with, talk to. Yeah, they're great. Moon, how do the evil buttons make you feel? Pissed off. He does not <laughs> like them. Moon is four. Who is Moon's favorite kid? I'd have to say Brie, 100%. Okay, here's how I feel. So our five-year-old grew up with Moon, and Moon has like a very weird attachment to him where he's like protective over him. But then our two-year-old, I think, is obsessed with Moon more than our five-year-old is. Yeah. Because my, like... The baby grew up with Moon, if that makes sense. The roles reversed. So, everybody's obsessed with each other in their own way. 
Can he sing? Yes, he just did some singing. Are you gonna get another animal? Not now. We have to move. I don't think he's possessive of us. I think he could be protective. I think almost any dog will be protective if you're a part of their pack, but I think that Moon's not possessive, that's for sure. You forgot to say goodbye, bye. Bye, have fun. Good night. We don't have a kitty cat. <laughs> why is Moon so cute? I don't know. I don't know, why are you so cute, Pup? You're such a cutie. Why are you so cute? Yeah, we follow Mueller too. And then our babies are with grandma today. So they go to daycare Tuesdays and Thursdays and then they go to grandma on Sunday. So those are the days that we try and work, go on live, answer your guys' questions, your comments, make sure we film. We create, yeah, we create content, we edit videos. Um, a lot of that time. happens, yeah. That was a big, that was a big yawn. Oh, thanks for making my day better. Does Moon have friends? Yeah. There's another husky in our development he plays with and then our best friends have a pit bull. And we take him to the dog park. We try to take him to the dog park as much as possible. I don't know about you guys, but some dog parks, unless you go the exact same time on the exact same day, you run into a lot of new dogs. And when it comes to meeting new dogs like Moon, he's very cocky and he kind of knows that he, um, he kind of acts like a hot shot, hate to say it. But if another dog tries to challenge that, Moon doesn't really let it happen. And I like to just avoid the nonsense. <laughs> How's your mood? He's chilling. He's ready for his bike ride. That's the, gonna be the video that we filmed today. We're gonna film Mark taking Moon on a bike ride. <laughs> what are your beauty secrets? His eyeliner is always like, he just has a very good person do his eyeliner. Questions? Yeah, you wanna check? Yeah. We're gonna check some of the questions that um, were asked on Instagram. Because we have a lot of love on Instagram. What are you looking at? Thing right here. Strange. It's annoying me. Oh, yeah, I saw that. I don't know what it is. It's a. Uh... Our couch is so cool. So, right. Where's my finger? Yeah, okay, so this couch, there's a storage right there. Look so at I, that finger, you guys. I put blankets there, and I can see one of the blankets, and it's triggering me. All right, you guys, so we have quite a few questions. Um, I'm not going to answer all of them because some of them are not really questions. Can he say my name, Yogi? We will give that a whirl. Um, when will you be posting puppy moon videos and photos? So for anybody who is on right now, we are going to try to like make a compilation of everything and get like a few of the videos that we had back in the day of baby moon. Someone asked, how do we deal with the tick problem? Oh man. I mean, tick medicine, pre like preventative, like use flea or tick medicine if you can and do your research because supposedly there's some stuff that can that is found to like hurt the dog or harm the dog's skin you know things like that but we have tick medicine unfortunately if they do get to his skin they do attach before they die so if one does get on him it's usually attached on him but it's not it died before it could even uh transfer lyme's disease where do you think you're going he wants his little toy. You want to play with play? dad? Uh, I'll move over here so you guys can play. So if you have a husky and like they're very energetic and you guys can't go outside, this is a great way to get their energy out. Drop, 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 drop. I'm gonna throw it. <laughs> Did you guys see him sliding? <laughs> I think it's so funny. I love when they do that. Oh, 
Another like tip for any dog owner, if you have a dog that greets people, not like, if you have a dog that greets people like aggressively, and I don't mean like biting them, I mean like they jump on them, they wanna smell them, they just wanna say hi, you can put peanut butter on that thing right there, put them on their bed, and then they'll be entertained by the, teen, the peanut butter for a while, and this way, their mind is taken off the fact that there's someone new in their home. Does moon shed a lot? Yeah, all the time. It's nonstop. People are always like, oh, it's only two seasons. No, it's 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Uh, do you prefer wood or rug flooring? Our entire house is wood. It's so much easier to clean up with the dogs. <sighs> huh? What you got going on over there? What are you doing over there? So I don't like carpet and also it has to do with our children. You know, they're playing on the floor a lot. So I would hate for like the hair and the dirt to get stuck in the carpet and then our boys play in it. So as the kids get older and like life moves on, I would love to have like a rug right here, but not, it's just not suitable for our house right now. Plus this way they can like run around, slide about, bring their toys, like. The amount of dust to like, I know you just said it, but the dust that collects in carpet is just, it would be a lot for us to handle with a dog like moving. Yeah. And the fact that our family is always always doing something outside and bringing the dirt from outside inside it's just way easier to have um have hardwood is that a bone no so it's kind of like a rubber the rubber yeah. toy so yeah, any kind of like rubber toy i would say you can like put peanut butter in the crevices and it helps because they have to like lick out of those little tiny crevices so it's really really great all right, so somebody on Instagram asked us, how old was Moon when you got him? When we got Moon, he was 16 weeks old. And a lot of you may know, but some of you may not know, Moon was not from a breeder. Moon was not from a shelter. And Moon was not purchased um, like anywhere else like that. It was on a Craigslist ad that we found him. The owner said that he was a little bit hyper and aggressive, very TV with their children. Um, but as soon as I saw him, I realized it wasn't him. It was more so the, the environment that he was in. Don't ever get a dog without knowing that like you're a hundred percent all in, you know, you have to like walk them, exercise them, train them. They're not going to come home a perfect puppy. They're going to need attention. That's okay. Whenever. I don't know who's playing with Maya, but this is Moon, and Moon's dad is here, and his name is Mark, and my name is Brittany. And Moon is a Siberian Husky. And Deborah, Moon has water right behind us, so whenever he wants water, he just goes to get it. There's always water in his bowl. And somebody asked, was it hard to teach Moon to talk? So we didn't really teach Moon to talk. He kind of like on his own got a bit vocal. There he goes. So we just allowed him to be vocal. There's his water. And the funny thing is I actually did teach him to speak, um, but then somebody told me that it's probably not a good idea to teach them too much on how to speak. Well, there's not enough. Oh, you're looking for your treat spot? You want to bring the buttons? Yeah. We'll grab the buttons up there. Yes, we follow Mika. Pretty much any Husky account we follow. What are these things? You remember these? I'll just put them right here. Yeah, that's perfect. Cool. I'll move that way. Wow. Moon just turned four. Moon like does not like the talking buttons. You'll see. You this? Talk. Talk. On the Hang on. Okay. Oh. Oh. Good boy. Oh, we gotta get him to stick to the ground. Oh. 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 
Good boy. Good boy. You see, he's over it. At least he did one. He wouldn't even do one for me. Who gave the name Moon? So, Moon actually was, dad brought him home without asking me and I was at work and I came home and it was like two in the morning and I looked at him and I was like, wow, he reminds me of the moon. Yeah, stick him on the ground or something. Good job. See, look at that. Maybe he's just, maybe he was just having a mood the other day. Does Moon nap a lot? Yeah. As long as he's like exercised, has gone to the park, has gone on a hike, gone on a walk, he'll just chill. I don't know the original talking husky. Who is that? I feel like it was that that Mila, Mila or something. So someone said... Or Mishka, Mishka, right? Someone also mentioned Millie. Mm -hmm. This one. What are you doing, huh? Is your dog a full moon or a half moon? <laughs> He's a full moon. Moon's He's it. full of love. Moon sit. Oh, you sit. Now you're in between the buttons. How are you going to press the button? Hmm? How are you going to press it? Moon, do you like treats? Paw. Moon there. Paw. Yeah, yeah. No. Yeah, paw. Yeah. Sit. Sit. No. Relax. There you go. Good, Good job. Does Moon stay awake in the night for how long? Moon's no. Up. So. Chew it. Oh, silly doggo. Sit. I'll sit. Not roll over, not roll over, not yet. It's Mishka. Mishka, yeah. So Moon is on the same schedule as our boys. So in this house, nighttime is between Moon, nine and lazy? 10. Close. Yeah, you're close. Yeah. Good, good oh. job. Very good. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah, so we go to sleep between 9 and 10, and we wake up between, like, 8 and 9. So Moon has been on the same schedule as us since day one. But, again, as long as you exercise them properly, they're going to know bedtime is bedtime, and they're not going to fight you. Was it difficult to train him? No. Mark and I both have our strengths, and Mark was, like, like he knew he had to train Moon, or I was going to be like, get the dog out of the house. So... I think that, like, <laughs> us both being yeah. home a lot Roll over. helped. Roll over. You got to back up first. Wait. Now down. 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 Good boy. Roll over. Good, good boy. Roll over. That was a good roll over good right into boy. the camera. Good job. Good boy. So to train him... He wasn't in a crate very often. I would say at most like three or four hours a day. Sit. Because otherwise, Mark and I were home. Sit. Sit. Up. Good boy. High five. Good boy. The rollover was so good, right? Moon has a video talking to Google. If you want to check out that video, it was so cute. Because we had Google play different animal sounds, and we saw Moon's reaction. Does Moon ever want to eat the food that we're eating? Of course, all the time. But he has a pretty sensitive stomach, so we really don't give him much. Boy. 
Cody. So right now I'm pretty much just like helping him balance. Mark's always been really good with like training him and being very patient where I was like, I don't have patience for this. You're peeing outside. And that's that. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. Does Moon love going on walks? Of course. Have you ever tried to find out who Moon's parents or siblings are? No, that would be a great idea to do a DNA kit test. So maybe that will be like one of our upcoming Sam. videos actually. Good boy. Because Champ and Tyson of Half Husky Bros just found out that they're like 3% related, which is so cute. Good boy, pup. The first video you saw was the I love you video. Oh my gosh, you guys have been with us for that long. That's amazing. That's a long time. Thank yeah, you so yeah. much. That that's is so like so amazing. I'm thirsty too. What games does he love to play with his Hubros? So really running around. Playing soccer is a big one. They love they all will play soccer. He does not like when the boys play with their guns. They have like laser what do they call it? Laser guns. Like they laser have Nerf guns. guns yeah. yeah. So he doesn't like those, but soccer is the, best, the biggest one. Bye. Thanks so much for hanging out with us. Good night. We'll see you next time. You wish you could pet Moon. Oh, hopefully we can like start doing meet and greets, guys, because I think that the world is starting to open up and everyone's safe and healthy and happy. Lunar, where are you going? Go on, Pop. Moon, go back to dad. Come here. He's got an itch on his leg. Where'd the buttons go? I'm gonna put them right here. Does Moon shed a lot? Yeah, he doesn't stop shedding. Nah, no, stop shedding. I'm gonna see if there's any like other cool like questions. Storm ha said, I don't have Instagram or TikTok or Facebook, but you're from the trigger video. Oh my gosh, thanks. Oh, so you found us right on YouTube. I love to hear that because that's so cool. Good night, Domini. Do a challenge now. Continuously call Moon while seeing the other way and avoiding him. So we actually did do that. Um, that video is also on our YouTube channel. He's so funny. Look at his blue eyes. I can't. They're so beautiful. We should do that live. You're from Northern, Northern Virginia. Virginia by DC. How far is it from New Jersey? Oh, Northern by DC, probably three hours, three and a half hours. There you go. Because Northern Virginia is pretty close to us. We're oh, like right smack dab in the middle of New Jersey. Like it takes us about an hour to get to um, New York City. An hour to get to Atlantic City, an hour get to get to Philadelphia. Hello is back. Storm, you're in New Jersey? Sto if that's Siberian Stormy or no? Storm the Pomsky. Oh, no, never mind. Oh, thanks. I thought it was uh Look at the... He was about to boop the camera. None over there, pup. Let's see. Let's Mark's going to answer some more of the Instagram questions. We get a lot of good ones over there. Do huskies start talking more with age? Mine is nine months, but barely makes husky noises. So, like, mute, Moon was rather mute when he was a puppy. Um, and then there was a couple times that he spoke in the car. But the one time I, I realized he was being a little bit vocal was that I love you video. I don't know, I was feeling like he was in a mode and I heard that that note set him off. And then that's kind of how he's been with his talking, but he doesn't talk if we want him to talk. It's, it's not like he just talks nonstop. Yeah, definitely um, does not talk nonstop. Yeah, he doesn't talk nonstop. Which works for our family. We, it would be crazy if he was talking nonstop and the kids were talking nonstop. Champ and Tyson are not related to Moon. Not that I know of. Champ and Tyson did a DNA test and they are like 3% related to one another. They're like cousins. So she was actually saying to change her um, Instagram handle to... What was she saying? Something about like cousins like 
half husky cousins yeah. or something so cute. It was so cute. I'm sure she'll come out with a video about that because that's amazing and it's awesome. Will you get another husky? So I think that we will get another husky. I don't think we would be getting any other breed of dog. It's probably going to be a husky for sure. Um, and down the line, once we have more space, that way, you know, it's not everybody in such close quarters just destroying the house because that could probably get hectic. Yeah, so if you guys don't know, we only have 900 square feet in our home. I'm trying to set you guys up over here. Um, so it's kind of close. No, because it's kind of comfortable Okay. once I get it. So when we bought this condo, we only had Mark, myself, and one baby. And then another baby was introduced and a husky was introduced. So, ah, sorry, guys. So we did not plan on growing our family in this home. So hopefully in like the next two years, we can move to a bigger home, get a little backyard, and... And then we'll introduce another husky into the family. And then, sorry, love, but someone asked, what breed do you like apart from huskies? German Shepherd. There's your answer. I say nothing. But. And I think <laughs> if, it wasn't, if it wasn't a German Shepherd, because German Shepherds, I, I do like them, but I like Shepsky, which is a German Shepherd husky mix. That would be amazing. And seeing... Seeing Tyson in real life, so it would cute. be cool to have that um, Golden Retriever, Siberian Husky, the Goberian, they call them. That would be pretty cool. And then everyone's asking you about Skaya, Maya, Mika. Yes. So we obviously don't know them in person yet because of our distance from one another. But we would love to hang out with them. Once the Canadian border is open, um, we're not too far from Canada, so we would love to go there and spend time with Skaya and Maya. They're very, very, very nice people. We chat with them all the time. Um, it's really amazing, like, when you meet people online and the community that you grow and build, it's almost like we already know them, but we would love to see them in person. Give some nice tips to maintain my Husky's fur. So... Huskies in general do take care of their fur for the most part on their own. Moon does a lot of like cleaning and licking like a cat. I would say like brushing, you know, one, at least once a week. He's already getting into the twitches, huh? I know. He's so tired. Maybe you guys will see him um, like run in his sleep. Yeah. But um, yeah, a couple brushes. I mean, don't take them to the groomers a lot. Don't bathe them a lot, especially with shampoos. Um, cause it'd be, it could be harmful to their skin. Um, but that's like the biggest thing. Honestly, really the biggest thing is what you feed them because yeah. depending on the food that you give them, their fur is just not, you could brush them all you wanted. You'll just be going over and over and over and they'll still have terrible fur. Emily said we have a nice big yard for him. No, we don't. We don't have any backyard. Yep. We have no yard. My mom has a fenced in yard. Thank you gosh because we go there quite often with moon and the amazing thing about that is we could take moon to my mom's backyard for 30 minutes and then he's tired yeah and free de la hoya said you want a husky like moon because you want moon maybe one day you can meet him that would be so cool your corgi would love to meet you guys yeah that would be awesome you want to brush his tail does moon like parrots I don't, I don't think know. he's ever met a parrot. I don't think he's met a parrot before. I, I think that when we went into the city was the first time that Moon saw a bird. So I don't know if you guys are familiar with New York City, but the animals, they have pigeons, they have squirrels. They're so used to seeing so many people that they don't run away when you get close to them. Yeah. Moon is not used to that at all. So when we got there, he was like, wait. These squirrels are letting me catch them. These pigeons are letting me catch them. So I feel like if he saw a parrot, the parrot would probably be freaked out because Moon would probably be trying to like get, get at it. We told you, he's like he likes his white meat, so the parrot might be delicious to him. Do you feed him raw meat and what's his diet? Yeah, only raw meat, only raw food, only fresh food, like vegetables, fine, fruit, yeah. fine. But we tried kibble when he was four months old. 
It did not do well in his digestive system, so he has been a raw fed dog for a really long time. Yep. 80% meat, 10% bones, 10% organs is typically how it goes. And when they're a puppy, you want to feed them like 5% of their body weight. So if they're 20 pounds, mm, yeah, 5% of their body weight. So that would be one, not one pound per day. Well, it's it's five percent of their body weight as a puppy, and then two to three percent of their body weight in meat per day, as like an adult. And then Deborah said, "Does Moon visit a zoo?" Yeah, so there's actually like a really cute, not zoo near us, but it's like a small area that has um, a pig. Oh, it's like a sanctuary. Yeah, it's, it's like, like a an sanctuary. animal sanctuary. It has a pig, it has um, peacocks, uh -huh. emus, yeah. ducks, pigs, goats. We have a video of that. Yeah. We have a video of him seeing them. And a deer he saw up close once. Mm -hmm. Oh, I do remember that. Does he have a girlfriend? Oh, I mean, Maya or Skye would probably be the closest to being a girlfriend, but the border is still closed, so we can't go see them. And it's so sad because when we went to have our like play date in New York, all the all of them were males. All the dogs Except there were boys. Was Kai, Kai was a boy too, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, they, they were had all a bow tie. they were all males, so like he didn't get a chance to uh, make a have a love. Honestly, D is probably right now is his mm. long distance relationship. So our best friends have a pit bull that we get to see like once every couple of months and those two love each other. I put a video up of them. Yeah, they're literally, they're, they're really cute. Yeah. How was Moon's reaction when he saw the mirror? He's unfazed by anything. I swear it's because he has human little brothers that he's just like an unfazed dog. Unfazed. Yeah, nothing unfazed. even surprises him. Anybody who has kids know, especially boys and especially multiple boys, it can get really chaotic and loud and wrestling and running and and Moon is just like, okay, mm -hmm. the usual. Doesn't care. Is he neutered? Yes. Yes, he is. And so somebody asked on Instagram, do you want another husky and what color would it be? White. Ooh. I want I a white girl. Like white. That would be good. A white girl would be beautiful. I think that we should name her Star. Oh so it would be gosh. like... The husky moon and star. How freaking cute would that be? <laughs> How? So adorable. I'm the only girl, Emily. I am. I have two <laughs> human boys. I have moon and I have Mark and all my... Just me. <laughs> I go crazy in here. It's rough. It's rough being mama in this house. It's very rough being mama. It is. Everyone's house. up my butt. No, yeah. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, she's it's not a good kidding. thing. Literally everybody. Both the boys are up her butt. Moon is up her butt. I always say like... In terms of affection, Moon and the boys, they choose me when it comes to wrestling and mm -hmm. running around and crazy stuff. But if somebody gets hurt or somebody needs cuddles, it's Moon, me. Bree, mm -hmm. Milo, go right to mommy. A white husky with royal blue eyes would be so pretty. You're oh right. My oh my it gosh. seriously would. I mean, so you know what? Like, we're so used to Moon's personality and how he does talk back to us that... I don't know, like, what would happen if we got another Husky that didn't talk back to us? I feel like the, the internet would, would have an uproar. <laughs> like, what would happen? I think, it would, I think it would be really cool to see them interact because when we had Milo, that was the first really small creature, human yep. creature, that Moon had to be around, and he did so good. For like the first like week or two, he was in this mode where he just knew that he had to be very well behaved and very protective and very attentive. And he would literally just sit there and watch over Mo over uh, Milo's bassinet. It was mm -hmm. the cutest thing ever. Also, Robert, thank you so much for hanging out with us. And I love cats and dogs, said lovely husky. Does Moon like to take baths? Yeah, he loves the bath. Yep. He just doesn't like being dried for too long, which I'm sure you guys have seen his reaction. Who's Moon's best friend? Probably. I would say Boron. Boron, yeah. yeah. The other husky that lives Our near us. Our neighbor has a husky named Boron, which in Russia stands for winter storm. Pretty cool name. What does Moon do when he wants to go for a walk? So right now he's chilling, but he 
literally just walks over to this door and stands at the door. He just stands. He just the stands door. there, and he and won't he, stop. <laughs> and he just he goes to the door. He stands. He tilts his head to the side, and he looks dead at us, almost like he's saying, "Like, get up, get up. <laughs> this is what I want to do." Does Moon like cats? Yes, yes, he does. Moon's just like an overall animal lover. Yeah, he's he boring really right now. Let's get the buttons back. He's straight chilling. He's so relaxed. I don't know why. Can a husky survive in Indian climate? If there's anybody from India right now, could you tell us, like, is it hot all year round? Is it not hot? I'm not sure. When I think of India, for some reason, I think that India is hot of a climate. But if it is, I don't think it's impossible to have a husky. You have a husky and you just make sure you have water available, um, air conditioning if possible. I mean, Mika is in Florida where it's hot like all year round, so. Emily said, I Googled it and it said they can't live in India. Uh, oh, for regulations, I think, right? I don't even know if it's just- In India, hot. it's hot and humid. Yeah, it's difficult. We have our seasons, but moon, when we got moon, it was September, which is like the end of our summer, which it's like peak heat. So moon learned at a really young age that either a bath or a swimming pool or a lake was the way mm -hmm. that he can cool down. So. Now, like, we'll probably have a, maybe a couple videos of us in the pool with him, maybe. Yeah. But um, he loves going into the pool. He swims. He, you know, he really enjoys it, especially when it's hot outside. What's your family's name? So most of you may know my name's Mark. And my name is Brittany, and then our two boys are Bree and Milo. Mooner, can you wake up and say hi to Lucy? Mooner, <laughs> wake up. <laughs> can you say hi to Lucy? Are we disturbing you? And Moon does like chicken nuggets. Somebody asked. Mooner, say hi, Lucy. Say hi, Emily. Say hi, Huxle. Hi, Cheryl. He's looking right at the back. And you guys watch when I open this bag, the ears. What do I got? Hmm? There he goes. Oh, we'll do anything. Listen, moon is the definition of will work for treats. All right, let me get 100%. it. 100%. I'm like laying on the floor. I'm going to sit. Good, good boy. What can you say? I wrote. I row. I row. I row. There you go. I row. I row. I row. I row. Come on, what are you doing? Look. Say hello. You distracted, huh? Pop. Alright, give me paw. Good boy. Other paw. Good boy. Some quick ones down. Good boy. Chew it, buddy. Chew it. Yes, I be. Roll over. I know I dropped it, but roll over. Good, Good boy. boy. You want to try and do stand? So sit. <laughs> sit. Good boy. Stand. Good boy. Good boy. You want to work on these buttons? Hmm? Our yes nos. Okay. Lunar, look. Do you want to go outside? Paw. Oh. No, paw here. Good. Good boy. job. Good boy. Oof, these are chunky treats. Right, come back here. Come back. Sit. I'm gonna let you pick this one. No, <laughs> why are you sitting down? I need you to press the buttons. Come on, sit. No, not roll over. No, 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 sit. Deborah wants Moon to sing. 
Muno, you want to sing? You say, oh, ro, ro, ro. Mommy's voice gets him going. Um, Muno, can you say, I love you. I love I love you. I love you. You're oh. a good boy. <laughs> he deserves a treat for good that. Good boy. Good boy. I like how his voice started getting deeper and higher. He's like, I, okay, I'm doing it. Someone asked what's outside the window. Really just like squirrels, trees, cars. Other dogs will walk by. Does Moon like to cuddle? No, not at all. How many miles does Moon walk every day? So when he was a puppy under two years old, we would do four miles a day. But um, now that he's four years old, he only needs about two. What happened to the dog beer? Oh, God. He really did not like that stuff. He did not like the dog beer at all. I'll have to do... Uh, maybe I'll put up a short of him not liking the dog beer. Because a lot of people have asked about that, but he really does not like it. And you guys noticed that, like, we had that crate video. And people were like, oh, my gosh, put some cushion in that crate. Da -da -da -da. We literally have a perfectly clean, nice-looking bed. Orthopedic, good for his back. It's elevated. He would much rather be on the cool floor. That's part of the reason why I think carpet... Yeah, it doesn't work. I don't think carpet would work. He'd be annoyed with, with the carpet. Minner, what are you doing? You want to speak? You ready to go outside, pup? You want to go outside? Hmm? He's so spoiled, right? It's so weird, though, because before he started speaking, there was like 40 people on. And then he starts speaking, now there's 56. Really? Yeah, I don't know if it's like, that's so weird. Mooner! You wanna talk some more to us? Hmm? 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 You wanna talk some more to us? Let's do it. Does Moon fart a lot? He used to fart, oh my God. He used to fart all the time. All the, it was, I think it lasted like a good year. And then he just stopped. He doesn't really fart at it all. It was so weird. You guys, every single morning, he would wake up, he would do his first stretch, and on that first stretch, it was nine times out of ten. Fart. Uh, yep. Now he burps more than he farts. Yeah, he definitely burps more. All right, Mooner, look at me. It's your bedtime. Bye, Huxtall. See you tomorrow. See you, Huxtall. Mooner, say bye. Mooner, say bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye. I burp. I burp. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Does Moon ever get tired of the camera? Yeah, probably, but he's beat. <laughs> no, we don't film him like 24-7. We really don't. <laughs> you got that's why you gotta chew it. Yeah. We try to just stick to like Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday oh, filming. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. That's very, like, Maya and Skaya. You mm -hmm. know how they have, like, soft? It's so funny. Like, female huskies sound so different than male huskies. He's definitely, like, got a mm -hmm. deeper baritone voice. I'm going to say, I love you. Hey, I love you. I love you. Why are you speaking so soft? Bye, guys. Have a good night's sleep. We'll see you guys soon. You want the treat? You have to use your big boy voice. Use your big boy voice. How rah, rah. Good, Good job. Boy. What time are you? Keep going. Keep going. Cool. Also, like the other day, I played um, Maya on YouTube. And Moon reacted to Maya. I don't know if he was reacting to Maya or Maya's mom, but it was so cute because... I don't get to like, yeah, Mark's gonna put Maya on, maybe her TikTok. Cause then we could keep going. It would be like cute. Wait, sit. No. Sit, Ask sit. Moon to press the talking button. We've tried and he just doesn't, I don't know. He did it much better for dad than he did for me. The other day I was alone with him and he was like, mom, I'm not doing this. I'm absolutely not. Moon, are you wanna listen to Skaya? Let's listen to Skaya first. Skaya barks though. Oh, okay, so let's listen. Maya really, Maya's a talker. Let's see. 
Maya's a chatter box, guys. And her mom is so nice. Why? <laughs> Keep that one below. Can you see banana? Can you Lunar. see Can you say banana? Can you see rainbow? Can you say banana? Can you say watermelon? What is he doing? Do? Yeah. You're so lazy. <laughs> I swear. Put, that's so funny. I'm gonna put himself on. Oh yeah. I feel like sometimes when he hears himself. So let's see. Yeah, he does like listening to his voice, too. It's like my voice and his voice, usually. Oh my gosh, too many videos. Like, Mishka passed away? I didn't know yeah, that. Oh, that's so sad. Ago. It's Mother's Day soon, Mooner. Yeah, are you excited? Did you get, did you get her anything? What are you doing, Pop? Hmm? I'm just gonna go on Instagram. It's got like trying to Oh, yeah, it's on. not, yeah. yeah. Right, Moon's Pop, being let's... adorable with his dad. I know, look at him. He's just chilling with him. It's he's so just, cute. He's, he's doing a heckin' hang. Oh, yes. what was that? What was that? What was that, Pupper? Moon should meet Skaya. I know, I promise. Whoa. Sorry. We're gonna try and meet Maya and Skaya. Wait a second, Pup. Wait a second, Pupper. Wait, sit. Sit. Wait a sec. Sit. Do you have a treat? Yeah. yeah. Sit. 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 Mm -mm. I'll give it to you in a second. Wait. Sit. I'll give it to you in a second. Maybe that's why he's not uh talking. You ain't already. There's no there's no explanation. You have your food. Oh, man. I'm gonna give it to you, bro. You don't care about that? <laughs> the puppy eyes. <laughs> give him um You want? I was gonna say like hide it, because I feel like it's distracting. Yeah. Your favorite video is Moon is him upside down and him with the dryer. <laughs> Keep the box bamboo video next. He doesn't talk in that one. We're trying to, the harmonica is probably the best one to have him react to. Who is that? Is that mommy? You hear yourself? What are you saying? Are you saying that you want the treat? Wait a second. Wait a second. Sit, 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 sit. I'll do it for you when you sit. Sit. Someone yes. said make him listen sit. to a wolf's howl and see his reaction. You want to hear a wolf mooner? Do a wolf. The boys always do that too. Like the babies, they're always like, ow, ow, ow. Squish. Ow, ow, ow. Oh my 
cute. That was a lot of talking. These are your cousins. He don't care. He probably knows it's fake. He's like, he's too smart. He's too smart for us guys. Yeah, the wolves don't do it. That's a good wolf. It's pretty cool to, cool to hear a wolf howl. But moon's on face. He's going a little bit. Can you hear the difference between him? Did we try the challenge where we run in opposite directions? Yes, we did. It's it's almost like when he hears a wolf, it's a little, little bit more different than like mm. an actual husky. We gotta do the meow at my dog, John. I know, we gotta do it today. That person's annoying. It's bugging him. It's bugging him, yeah, he's annoyed. It's bugging you, huh, bud? Moon doesn't react to specific songs, and Moon would love to meet other doggos, but we live in New Jersey and no other famous dogs are in New Jersey that I know of. Does Moon like to play with small dogs? Yes. I mean, he's kind of like unfazed by them, but he will play with them. Can you boop him? <laughs> he's really in chill mode right now. I know. Maybe what we'll do is we'll go to lunch and then we will do the bike riding video. Yeah. So Moon isn't really triggered by any words. A lot of people ask us that, but Moon's not really triggered by many words. Yeah. Outside? Treat? Park? Food? Eat? Oh, maybe that. Maybe eat. <laughs> Chicken? Turkey? Hot dog? Moon, can you get an awa awa? He doesn't really do those awa awas. He, he more so is just like, ow, ow. Moon, you want to you wanna say hello? hello? That was his no shake. I always tell people, when he doesn't want to do something, he shakes no. And he typically goes, and he scoffs at us. You guys, we're almost at 10,000 subscribers on YouTube. I know. Moon, come here, pup. Moon, I come. Deborah, we would love to meet them, but they don't live near us. You have almost 10,000 subscribers. Subscribers, buddy. Hmm? Almost 10,000. You see how he loves his butt he rub? He loves the butt rub. So if I stop, gets go pissed. Ahead, I'm like, okay. Give me the butt. Stop. Can I get that? No? Look at him. He's like, uh. <laughs> you enjoying the butt? Huh? 
I can't stand the wires. Now there's people outside, so he's looking out there. What date did we get moon? I think it was like September 10th. Yeah. Look how cute you are, Mooner. Are you a good boy? How often do you brush him? Not often. I mean, at least once. At least I would say once a week. The kids like doing it too, which I think is so funny. Like lately, the baby's been taking the brush out and like brushing him. You, you watched the Power Positivity video? Thank you. Oh my God, I loved that video. They did such an amazing job. I think we're going to go get lunch now, guys. And then we'll create our next video. But thank you so much for hanging out with us. That was so sweet of you to stay, spend your afternoon or your evening with us. I, Moon just booped us. Yeah, he came right up to the camera. <laughs> we appreciate all of you. We love all the questions you guys always have for us. Thank you guys so much for the love and the support. Moon is a very, very blessed dog, and so is our family. Thank you so much. And we look forward to seeing you guys again soon. Let us know what day works out better for you guys, Tuesday or Sunday. Both days are fine. We are getting into, like, wedding season, though, so Mark and I are a little bit busier, but we appreciate you guys so much. We'll do a couple more tricks, and then we'll and hang up. Yeah. Nurse it. Love from Finland. Wow, Down. thank you. Down. No, sit. Down. Fan from India. Hi. Down. It's late in India, huh? Down. That's stand. I'll give it to you though because it was cute, but I shouldn't stand. Good boy. Sit. Stand. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. We appreciate it. Mm, sit. Sit. Good boy. Down. Lay down. Good boy. Roll over. Good boy. From Italy. Okay. Thank you. Have a great day to you as well. Good night. Good night. Good afternoon. Have a good day. Mooner, can you say goodbye? Can you say bye? Mooner. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Moon. Bye bye. Bye bye. I'm... Moon. Bye bye. Ah, uh, you're getting out of the picture. Hey, bye bye. Hey, bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Right. Bye. Bye. <coughs> Good boy. But you have to say it nicely. Bye bye. <coughs> that was better. Bye bye. You say bye. Ah, <coughs> oh, there you go. Good job. Good boy. All right. See you guys soon. Thank See you, you guys. so much again. Thanks so much for hanging with us.